those fucking Empire Secessionists. Yeah. I have liked the color blue um, all my life. I mean, my room right now is painted like three different shades of blue. I will never be able to look at the color blue on a flag ever again. Oh, you'd better be oh, kidding fuck. me. The beastmen are raiding the Hel province of Helmgard. Shit. Here we go. Money is power. I can... In the past, I did nothing. But now I can take the thousand prestige hit to arrange favors. And boost my imperial authority to one. Elector count fealty increased chance is 5% now. Growth is 3 in all provinces. Tax rate is 5% extra in all provinces. By the comic. Summon the electric hounds. How, how do I do that? Up, up, yes. down, down, left, right, left, right, BA. Start select. I can build something called the Red Moon Inn that gives me a garrison of a Thane, an Empire Captain, a Witch Hunter, and a Bright Wizard. What? Holy fuck. I'm doing it. And it also adds walls to the settlement. Yeah, that gives you a garrison of four heroes. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just sitting here like, yeah, I mean, you didn't have to sell me on that before. What? I've just been put to siege by an orc in Helmgard. Jesus, that's a lot of them, and he severely outnumbers me. How? Alright, I'm gonna fight this Oh, out. fuck. Yeah. Oh, it's because your garrison is fucked up. Yeah, I know. I thought putting this force here would deter somebody, but then he just plug walks in with this army. This will end in tears and blood. Well, at least I have outrider cavalry here. Oh, and I've got a mortar! Nice! Hang on, let me just make sure that mortar's range is as good as I think it is. That's pretty good, yep. Alright. Ready, steady, go. Fucking need their lord. Oh no, no, you are not. Water. Where are you I firing? mean, on the plus side, your power projection has tipped slightly in your favor. Oh my god, Umbarogan's getting wrecked down there. Fuck. My warriors flee. Where? Ah oh, shit, we're being overrun. Oh, they've broken through. All right. Shit, it's really not going well. Oh. Yeah, there we go. Uh, that wasn't good. Uh, that was. Let's see if they. Fucking terrible, man. That sucked. Let's see if. Let's see if they take this place or if they just. The orcs. They'll probably just burn it. Close defeat. And he raises it to the ground. Oh no! He did he take it? No, he raised it to the ground. And what happened to my lord and all of his units? Possibly dead. Uh, the Halfling Pudding Grudge. I need to use a hero to successfully perform an action against the following settlement, Karak Ziflin. Under Morgrim's disappointed glare, did the dwarves of Karak Ziflin steal away a cook bound for the kitchens of Karaz a Karak. The secret of his nutty fig pudding recipe was the reason. A spiteful move to deprive the High King of one of his favorites in petty retribution for a difficult Reckoner's inspection. A grudge has been recorded, and there will be no negotiations with Zifflin until they give up the Halfling. Karak Zifflin. I'm trying to find this guy. It, they're near you, I think. Yeah. They're the ones, they're right next to Helmgard. Urgrok Cracktooth. Ugly ass crackhead, more like. <laughs> Ugly rock a crack in my tooth. Oh, here we go. Another battle. Come and watch with me. I think this is going to be the final battle of the night. Mr. Cracktooth here thinks he can screw with me. He's definitely got that meth face. <laughs> also, from my view, that rock looks like a dick. Yeah, that rock your dudes are right in front of kind of looks like <laughs> a dick from the wrong angle. It looks like a, it looks like a dick from every angle, man. Uh, that is that is fair. Oh fucking hell! I'm all right. I'm countercharging their leader. Boom! And I'm about to break him in three, two, one. He's dead. 
Or he's wounded, whatever. And then all of their fucking morale immediately starts dropping like rocks. Yeah. Oh, they're in there? Shit. Don't stop until they're all dead. Yeah, that sounds about right. Oh, my Rags Guard are, are eating shit. Holy crap. Three minutes. Oh my god. My pistoliers on the flank just shredded one of their last units. Uh -huh. I'm just gonna make sure a lot of these army, a lot of these remaining units just kind of get run down. How do pistoliers fight in melee? I wonder. Oh, they actually have like Cossack sabers. That's pretty neat. That's as good as it's gonna get. Boom. Sorry that took longer than it should, but I needed to make sure that a lot of those guys died. Nice. I mean, you say nice, but I need, need, need more cavalry. Like, that's my deciding factor right now. My infantry is a lot weaker than all my neighbors. And if I had to pick the, between, like, these whippy but fragile outriders and just the Reichsguard knights. You go with the knights. I, I have to go with the knights. Like range is good and all, but breaking someone's formation and sending them into chaos is better. Oh yeah. Like it doesn't matter how fast you can get pistols onto the front line if you just are the front line. <laughs> How are you finding the game so? Far? I enjoy it. I really enjoy it. Like I thought. Yeah. The to like medieval two and Napoleon were pretty neat for being historical games. But I never played the campaigns. I thought the setting... I mean, history leaves much to be desired unless you can change it. But this, where it's just like a blend of all of those elements, of cavalry, of ranged units, of flintlock weapons, artillery, all that sort of stuff. And then, of course, like, infantry, but all of it's put in the Warhammer universe. I think this is one of their best games yet. Oh, at least I got a grudge to take back Iron Rock. I think you're doing the right thing auto-resolving battles. I just don't have the units to do that yet. Yeah, I mean, these these battles, I, it's, they're easy for me to auto-resolve. Um, you're also fighting a lot because... smaller armies than I am. If I really want to spend 5,000 out of my 5,100 gold right now, I could start building a gunsmith and be able to make handgunners and mortars. I think I go for it. I think I fucking just go for it. Go for what? Gun um, bad? I might even auto this. Yeah. I've got like... 7 eighths on them. I suggest you auto it then. Yeah. Yeah. I don't think I lost... I lost 63 units. 60... or 63 troops. Captured Sweet. 42 of the enemy too. And you got your fort. Gonna finish it off? Oh, oh the got the army? Yeah. I was actually going to Helmgard, and I could either pay money to colonize it, which I don't. Search the ruins, or do nothing. I'll do nothing for now. No peace, just war. Let's finish this. Alright. Oh. And more skull rocks. Look at that <laughs> They're everywhere. They are everywhere. I blame you dwarves for putting these skull rocks there. Beautiful as they are, but I think you guys have too much time on your hands. Wait, who carves the skulls? I blame the dwarves. You blame the dwarves. I blame chaos. I mean, you might be right. Corrupting influence of chaos on the realm slowly twists rock faces into the shape of skulls. You want to take control of my Reichsguard for this battle? Uh, nah. I'm good watching. Alright. <clears throat> Fucking gobos. Orcs and gobos. 
Oh, that was the enemy lord. <laughs> he was just in the back getting shot at by my ranged units. So that happened. I'm just... I think I need to offload some of my troops and colonize this outpost here. Execute captives. I got some loot from that. Got another ogre blade. Doesn't look like any enemy armies nearby. I think... I can colonize Helmgard without a problem. It costs 2,011 gold now. Shit. 